This is my biggest orange haul ever. In my wish list for the longest time, Ali Core. To the point that I've said that about. So this is my second out of five shoes that I got. It's so me. It's very Christmas. This is Mickey's favorite brand. So I actually got a lot. I am so happy with this one because I've got a lot of things that I'm going to show you. I'll tell you what I'm going to show you. It's all for me. I deserve it. Sydney, I will. I am in my Kelly fantasy era. The reason why I ended up buying four Kelly buckle right here for my boots. Anyway, enough of that. I got. Okay, let's go. Hey guys, it's Ray, and welcome back to my channel. Merry Christmas, Chad. Anyway, so for today's video, I am finally sharing with you guys my Turkey haul, and I mentioned that I feel like this is my biggest orange haul ever. Well. Di ata. Meron pa ng orange. Meron ng big orange haul last year. But in terms of like value and the things that I really, really want, kasi narealize ko yung usual Hermes, yung usual orange haul ko, gifts siya lagi, di ba? Lagi for gifts. But this time, it's all for me because I deserve it. It was my birthday. I also want to quickly mention that this video is in partnership with Emma Sleep, our favorite mattress. Okay, let's go. First two items, I feel like you guys know this already, so I'm gonna quickly show it to you guys because I showed this to Rio and to TikTok, but if you haven't seen it, then ta -da! So this is the Chanel Ballet Flats. This has been around for the longest time, but I'm never gonna feel you need to buy it because it reminds me of my shoes when I was in grade school. Past few weeks, sobrang nahid ako ng ballet core on TikTok, and I've been seeing a lot of cute ballet outfits. A lot of people have been buying the one in tweed version, so I realized again I want it. So I'm actually pairing with Jamie with this one. I went for the usual beige black Chanel combo. Haven't worn it. Maybe in Sydney I will. Let's see. Okay, I told myself this is the only thing I'm gonna buy. Obviously a joke. I got this literally five hours after I landed Istanbul. But the reason why I got this is because you know I've been looking for Chanel 22 for the longest time to the point that I've said that I got backpack. This is a lesson to not buy something if you don't truly 100% like it. Because you know, in the right timing, you can see si Chanel 22 na hindi backpack. This is a small one, gold hardware. The reason why I super love this is because the logo is in black, very low key. It is in caviar leather, just like majority of my classic flaps. So I have this scratch and try and it's super high maintenance. And it's just a perfect everyday bag, airport bag, in bag. I don't know. But yeah, I know it's very similar to my Chanel 22 backpack, but I love it talaga. And I honestly think, sa sabi ko na kasi ito judge niyo ako pag nangyari siya. I honestly think I'm gonna get another one in another color, just because sobrang functional niya talaga for me. So this is my second out of five shoes that I got this trip. So yes, I did get a lot of shoes this trip because every time I ask people to style me, like get to the marks, to the nims, to the elts, the problem nila sa akin shoes. I have the smallest feet in the world. I am size four, so it's so hard for them to pull out shoes for me. So I do have to invest on my own. And nakakainis kasi ito dapat yung suot ko ng bow ball but I didn't find it on time but at least I found it now so in the future we have something to wear. I know it looks intimidating, it looks super duper tall but the reason why this is the specific heels I am looking for is because of the platform. So the platforms are super high so it gives you the illusion na sobrang steep nung pa ako but in reality it starts from here. So it's more comfortable. This was available in white also, but I realized this is mas maraming pagbabagayan. Anyway, before we head to all the good orange stuff, I just want to quickly share with you something about my Emma mattress. Hey guys, so I know you are enjoying watching our turkey haul, but this is just a quick update. It's been three months since I got my new Emma mattress. 
I just want to quickly talk about it because when I got it from the very start, I loved it immediately. This is my second Emma mattress. The first one I got in 2022 and then I upgraded to this Diamond Hybrid. To begin with, I really love it but when I got home from Turkey, that's when I realized I have the best mattress. I really saw the difference especially in terms of like body pain. I tell you guys, I feel like I'm Alola trapped in a 27 year old body because my body aches a lot especially when we travel because Nag cave hotel kami, nag Airbnb kami, and nothing compares to my Emma mattress. By the way, the reason why it's called a diamond hybrid is because it has a cooling effect, so it's very fresco when you sleep. Di ko ata na share sa inyo pero our aircon is always at maximum 25 na kasi lamigin si Migi. Pero okay lang siya, like hindi mainit yung feeling. It's the best because it has the motion isolation technology. You guys probably heard of that from a lot of the celebrities who loves Emma as well. So I'm gonna show you guys a video where my brother is jumping on the bed right beside Ellie, my niece. And I think she was mga 3 months nito and hindi, siya, hindi talaga siya nababother kahit humatalan yung brother ko because again of the motion isolation technology. And yes, na Budol ko yung brother ko into buying the diamond hybrid one. And it's a budol that's very, very worth it. There's a reason why it's called the mattress of superstars. Like, a lot of people trust Emma for a reason. And I do have a 10% discount code for you guys. I will put it right here. So, if you want to purchase, make sure you use that code so that you would get extra discounts. And since nakita niyo na yung jumping video ni Diko, I will show you guys here as well. Like, I would put a uh, glass over here and jump next to it so that you guys will see. My favorite thing about this mattress is the fact na parang feeling ko it contours around my body. Medyo weird ako matulog. Like, malikot ako honestly matulog. Pero hindi sumasakit yung katawan ko because it, it kinda adapts with my position kahit gumalaw-galaw pa ako. Again, I do have a discount code for you guys. If ever you're gonna buy it, go ahead and use that for an additional discount. And by the way, these pillows are from Emma as well. So, sabay nyo na siya sa 10% discount if ever you're buying. Okay, so that is it. I hope I boodled you right. So, I'll go back to our haul. Okay, let's go back to the video. Thank you so much for watching that part. It was an unskippable ad. I'm sorry for that. Last two items before we go to the orange stuff. I got this cap from Montclair. My love for this brand started when I went to Switzerland. This is Miggy's favorite brand and sobrang na influence niya ako doon. So it's just a very simple navy blue cap with just the Montclair patches which is perfect for everyday. We have to protect our scalp from the sun. And if ever you guys go to Turkey, especially in Kas and in Antalya, you have to buy their robes, towels, what nila. You guys know that I'm a homot girly whenever I prepare. Whenever I'm sitting on the makeup chair, I always put robes and like homot. So I actually actually got a lot, but since we're shooting in a cute studio today, I didn't bring all of them. I got a total of two humot and two bathrobes. Not really bathrobes, parang robe, parang. And isa lang yung nadala ko. And I like it so, so much. Fabric is so, so nice. They make, they're made out of organic material. Yung feels niya actually reminds me of Hermes. Not kidding. It's also the reason why I ended up buying four. And even the stitching is so nice. So yeah. This one, for price reference, this is around 5,000 pesos. The pack na kailangan kong iuwi to at mabigat, pero ginawa ko guys. It means it's nice. By the way, thank you to my Louis Vuitton PH family for my moon cakes. I'm cute. Okay, let's now go to the exciting part, which is my Hermes haul. I went to an Hermes in Istanbul. And they didn't have anything, literally anything. At some point in my life, I stopped going into Hermes stores already because you would get the answer, I'm so sorry, we don't have stocks. I'm so sorry, maybe next time. Alam niyo yan, like if you shop from Hermes, you know that. Since I only shop and build my profile here in the Philippines, but I don't want to splurge in other countries already. But, 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 this trip changed my mind because I realized you should always, always check Hermes in all airports. So while I'm here in the Philippines, I had to build my profile to get my very first Birkin. But in airports, how are they gonna do that when people literally just come and go? So I talked to two SAs, one from Turkey, one in Abu Dhabi, and they said na pag dumating ka doon tapos may bag, and then you ask, then they're gonna give it to you. I didn't get a bag, but I got most of the stuff that's in my way. 
wish list for the longest time na hindi ko mahanap sa mga reseller and uh, stores even in Europe and dito sa Philippines. So let's go. So first is this car and I'm in the process of renovating my room and nakita namin ito ni Vicky. Sabi ko, ang ganda niyang i-frame. Like, it's gonna be so nice frame. The colors are so perfect. It's so me. It's so Hermes. Actually, hindi ito yung first choice ko. Yung first choice ko is yung nakahang. Parang, imagine mo yun. Parang cartoon version of the kabayo, but in blue and orange. It was so, so nice, but they wouldn't give it to me because they said it's a... It's a display piece. Tapos they were giving it to me in another color, pero muted na yung color, so hindi na siya masyado piece. Next! I am so happy with this one because at talaga ko naman ang hinahanap ito. Yan yung mga linyan pag gusto mo i-justify yung purchase mo. I've been looking for this for the longest time. It's been in my wish list for a while. Ay, pero legit talaga. The Kelly belt, hindi ko talaga ito mahanap. So, it's just like a one-size thing. I love how it doesn't have a butas-butas. Like, you know how belts have holes? It doesn't have that. You just have this beautiful Kelly buckle. I honestly wish it's in Palladio. I hope one day I can get it in Palladio. But it's just adjustable here. Ang neat niya tignan. As in, ang linis-linis niya lang tignan. Diba? Walang butas, walang anything. It's just a cute buckle. For simple outfits, it's gonna look really cute. Okay, next. I am in my Kelly, um fantasy era, but hindi ko talaga ito sinasadya. As in, hindi ko talaga sinasadya na lahat ng mabili ko is Kenny. And this belt I got in Abu Dhabi. Tapos, Pilipino yung SA doon. They were very, very kind. This I got in Turkey together with the scarf. This one was super new year release. As in, the store got it the morning of the day I arrived. And this is my size. So, sobrang nakakagulat na meron silang size ko because I have tiny feet. It also has this Kelly buckle right here. Perfect for everyday meetings, ganyan. Tignan niyo yung difference ng gold sa Palladium hardware. Diba? Ang ganda ng Palladium. So, parang biglang, why is it gold? Last two. And it's my favorite out of everything. Okay, so this one I was trying to get when I was in Switzerland because I saw Bernice wearing it and then she told me how much she loves it. Tapos yung pinitagas ko na pumuna siya ng Kelly boots and I feel like every girl needs one pair of good black boots. So why not make it her mess? <laughs> so you guys, smart to talaga ako. Tagapin niya lang. I got the black boots in Kelly but in Palladium hardware. It is so, so beautiful. Also got it in Abu Dhabi. Tapos sabi nung Pilipino dun, sabi ko, Kuya, meron ba kayong English ever? <laughs> so I asked him, like, if they had the Kelly boots. Tapos sabi niya, like, mama ng size mo. Sabi ko, 34, pero kahit 35, 36, papatulan ko na. B. My 34! Kahit isong million. It's 34. So I am the happiest because it fits me really, really well as in super sakto. Sabi nila, sakto daw yung ganito natin sa paa natin. Let's try. Tama. But anyway, I'm not gonna open the other one, but yeah. And honestly, feeling ko, my heart will break kasi when I was trying this, hindi lang ang mga lahat ng maayos. Like, nakakat na tatakot akong i-crease siya. So, hindi ko, once I start using this for travel, mayroong isang part na sobrang mag-crease. Hindi ko alam kung dito or dito. So, I know it's gonna break my heart, but shoes are made for walking so Before I go to the last item, marami pa lang nagtatanong about the Turkey visa. Turkey as a whole, like, is it an expensive country to go to? Is it accessible for Filipinos? In Miggy and I's case, it was a different parang visa application because we both have a US visa and I have the Schengen visa from Europe. Ang ginawa namin, if you are holding those types of visa, you just apply online. Magbabayad lang kayo using credit card and literally minutes after filing online, you will receive your e-visa via email. So that's how easy it is. Jamie's case, since 
I think expired na yung Europe visa niya. She had to apply and it was pretty fast. You just bring your requirements. Tapos, meron din kasi mga agency that will help you. Pero I believe na DIY si Javi. Second question, is Turkey an expensive country? It depends on you. Because flight, there are a lot of sale flights. For in our case, we got business class round trip in Etihad na sale. So, nagsa sale din naman sila. And if you book in advance, you'll be able to get a good price. Accommodation and food and even transport is surprisingly affordable. For example, Uber nila, very cheap compared to Japan. Japan is so expensive. Food, mura compared to Europe. And accommodation, Airbnb, like meron kami 6,000 per night. Tapos tatlo na kami. Affordable in that sense. But when you get to Cappadocia, like the hot air balloon, it's like 200 euros per person. The Turkish night will cost you 40 euros per person. So I would say Cappadocia is expensive in terms of the activities in Cappadocia could be expensive, but it's worth it. Because yun yung mo, parang And if you have any more questions, let me know. Okay, so this is actually a cheat. This is not from this is not from Turkey, but I ordered this when I was in Turkey and it landed in Manila the moment I landed in Manila. So it's here in the Turkey haul because it's also part of my Kelly fantasy. It's gonna seal the deal. So my first two Birkins, I got it sa store. So it was a retail price. So you know how much would it would that be? You can research. And you know, na kapag sa resellers ka bumili, it's gonna be like times 3 na or depende sa kulay ganyan. So I really never thought that I would start buying Hermes bags from like resellers or personal shoppers because I was able to get from the store. But you know, building your profile is sometimes parang it's tiring, especially when the things you want to buy aren't there. So, minsan parang nagpo-push ka to buy things na hindi mo naman talaga gusto just for the sake of making, just for the sake of building your profile and to get to the amount you need to get that bag. It's a whole thing I wasn't comfortable sharing before kasi nilisip ko parang, ala, baka, baka bawal siya. But I see people on TikTok talking about this. And it's the reality of the situation buying from the brand. So, why not share? So, yun, para napagod na lang ako na every two weeks mag visit ako ng store, bibili ako ng something, ipagre-regalo ko, ganito, ganyan. So, ayun, dumiretso na ako dun sa item yung gusto ko talaga. Para, ganun din kasi siya eh. Para, if you spend so much on little things to get to the bag. Tapos, like, right now, I don't wear the bracelets anymore. I don't wear the orans anymore. Overuse ko na sila. So, parang naisip ko, instead of spending so much on little things, go straight to the bag that I want na lang talaga. But, don't get me wrong, I love my SA here in the Philippines. He's so good. He's very kind. So straightforward. That's why also I got my first work kit from him. And I still visit and I still go to the store and buy the things that I truly, truly want. Anyway, enough of that. I got, this is my dream color for a Birkin. But I never thought I would get a Kelly because I'm a Birkin girl. Di ba? Parang pagkawak mo yung Birkin, sakto yung size niya eh. Kasi ganyan lang siya. So parang, parang, hmm, the proportion of this is not proportioning with me. The thing with the Birkins, you always carry it like that. So it could be really tiring. This one has a strap so you can cross body. Ta-da! So I got this from Miss Kat of Luxury Wish. I also bought my Ernest Constance from her. It's a fair price for me. This is the Kelly 25 in gold hardware. This is the perfect size, especially if you want it for investment purposes. Because it's the size na Venice mas yung value. So, yeah, but anyway, that is it for our turkey haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Also, huge, huge thanks to Emma again for sponsoring this video and to everybody who watched our turkey vlog. Kung haul lang yun, 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 yun,